Hi, I'm Dr. Dave. The frontalis muscle is thin, of a quadrilateral form, and intimately adherent to the superficial fascia. It is broader than the occipitalis and its fibers are longer and paler in color. It is located on the front of the head. It has no bony attachments. Its medial fibers are continuous with those of the procerus. Its immediate fibers blend with the corrugator and orbicularis oculi. Thus attached to the skin of the eyebrows open square bracket 1. And its lateral fibers are also blended with the latter muscle over the zygomatic process of the frontal bone. In the eyebrows, its primary function is to lift them, thus opposing the orbital portion of the orbicularis, especially when looking up. It also acts when a view is too distant or dim. From these attachments the fibers are directed upward and join the galea aponeurotica below the coronal suture. The medial margins of the frontals are joined together for some distance above the root of the nose, but between the occipitals there is a considerable, though variable, interval, occupied by the galea aponeurotica. It could be part of occipital frontalis muscle. Thanks for listening. Goodbye.